राम 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 सर्वे वेलकम टू क्लास फोर ऑफ रंगवली रचनम पुष्प रतनम विशुल बिगिन विद प्रेयर गुरु रे वगति ही गुरु मेव भजे गुरु नई वसहस्मुरवे न गुरो परम शिशुरस्मी गुरो मतिरस्ति गुरो मम पी गुरो स्वागत सर्वे Namaste to all Ram Ram how is it Ram Ram ma'am Ram Ram ma'am doing today Ram Ram I'm going to switch to I don't see the videos on can you all switch if you bore sarvina is ready bharati is ready medha is ready mahati is ready who else is ready for some flower stringing yes i'm still waiting for a few more to switch on their videos just let's just give them 30 seconds to settle down is that okay ram ram ma'am ram ram jayantika manasvi niketana is on sumed he did lovely columns yesterday tejaswini is on vishuddha meera hari priya your columns were very beautiful yesterday are you ready for some talents today yes ma'am good harshita jyoti okay very good before we go into the garlanding part um do you know any bhaktas who offered garlands to bhagwan to show bhakti and and right you all have heard heard about andal very good who was andal uma devi uma devi sir uma devi Bhuma Devi's avatar. Correct. Who was she? She is a famous Arvar. She is a famous Arvar. Correct. Arvars were how many of them? Twelve. Twelve. Correct. Twelve Arvars and only one lady Arvar. Like I think Niketana answered. Uh, she was the avatar of Bhuma Devi. and she offered her bhakti to which god krishna ma ma lord, lord krishna or mahavishnu Tandha. by making by making garland by making garlands her father was father who was andar's father periyarvar periyarvar correct so periyarvar found andar in a beautiful garden usually garden has lots of tulsi lot yeah tulsi but usually whenever we say garden what are you reminded of flowers flowers right so periyarvar used to make garlands for mahavishnu where did he live which place does anybody know where periyarvar lived Ma'am, Sri Valli Puttur. Sri yes. Valli Puttur. That is correct. Sri Valli Puttur. It is very famous for a, a sweet called Palgova. The next time, if you visit Sri Valli Puttur, have darshan and make sure you have yummy Palgova. 
so he also lived in sri viliputur and he had a beautiful garden full of flowers and lot of tulasi plants so you know what he used to do every morning he used to wake up early in the morning even before the bees touch the flowers he would wake up pluck all the flowers with lot of devotion and then he would make lovely garlands for whom for krishna lord for lord the lord ah he would make lovely garlands for the deity or god in shrivaliputtur his name is called vatapatra shayi so he used to make these garlands and then one day and then one day what happened as usual early in the morning on a friday he was plucking flowers in the garden you know what happened he suddenly heard a baby wailing wah, 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 wah. and then he was shocked i am hearing a sound of a crying baby and then he found the baby next to a tulasi plant we call it tulasi madam he saw a beautiful baby next to the tulasi plant he looked around to see if the parents of the baby are around but nobody was around so he decided to bring up the baby girl by himself she had very beautiful hair and was bright so he named her kodai what did he name her kodai kodai and then what happened she grew up listening to the stories of lord krishna why because he was also a devotee of lord krishna so every day he used to wake up in the morning pluck flowers make garlands and then he used to narrate lot of stories of lord krishna so this little girl kodai grew up listening to the stories of krishna and one day she decided she only wanted to marry krishna how she is in she is here living as a girl in shri viliputur krishna is there in another loka how can she marry but she was very sure she said no appa no papa he will definitely come and i will only marry lord krishna and then she wanted to see how she would look on her wedding day whenever wedding happens what do the bride and the groom uh, wear around they wear garland garland they wear garlands right they wear garlands they wear big garlands so she decided okay let me try wearing the garland that periyalwar has made for lord krishna and see how i look and then she sneakily placed the garland back on the plate and then the father took the garland to the temple when he took the garland to the temple he saw tiny bits of kodai's hair on the garland and then he got shocked why because he was the only one who garlanded it and then he was he was a very clean person so no way that a hair would stick to the garland he was very disappointed so he came back made new garland and then went back but lord vishnu did not accept that garland you know what he said i don't want this garland i only want the garland that kodai wore only then he realized that kodai stealthily wore the garland and gave it to periyalwar and then what happened he came back took the garland again that kodai had worn and then gave it back to lord vishnu and he accepted and finally they got they both got married in shrirangam where she just merged with ranganathar there so this is a form of devotion usually we will say right whenever we offer nevedyam whenever we do something oh this is for bhagwan don't touch it we have to offer first and then only we can eat it you would have heard your parents say that it is nevedyam don't eat i am making vada usually my daughters come running can i have vada can i have vada i'll be like no wait we'll have to offer and then we have to uh, have it after offering but this is a form of bhakti we all also have bhakti towards bhagwan but kodai's bhakti that she had was supreme it was so pure and beautiful and all the time she would think about only krishna 
So we all are going to become little Kodais and little Krishnas today to make what? To make, to make garlands. garlands. To make garlands. So after you learn today, you should make sure that whenever you celebrate a festival, whenever you go out and you're able to buy some flowers, especially on auspicious days, even if it is a little garland, spend some time doing the garland and offer it to the deities in your house, in your puja, puja room. Auntie? Yes? Yes? Auntie, uh, Amira was also a bhakti of Krishna. Correct. True. Meera also was a bhakta of Krishna. She offered her bhakti through what did she do? Music. Singing. Ah, music. music. Keep the correct. So Meera many, offered it. So many people would give her food in the uh, in the paisam, but she would always mm -hmm. offer to Krishna, then only she will drink it. Correct. Very nice. Looks like you you she know sang, she, uh, she sang uh, the praise about Krishna until her death. Even correct, when she was correct. dying. Yeah, also, also is a devotee of Krishna. She offered her bhakti through Kirtan. So you can offer bhakti in any way, right? I think I mentioned it during one of the sessions that we have last time. So bhakti is something which is very universal. When bhakti enters tirtam, water, when bhakti enters water, what does it become? It becomes tirtam. When bhakti enters food, what, did, what does it become? It becomes pa, prada, uh, prasadam. Prasadam. When bhakti enters travel, if you travel with lot of bhakti, what does it become? Pilgrimage. It becomes pilgrimage, correct. When bhakti enters service, it becomes seva for Bhagavan. When seva. bhakti enters music, it becomes... What does it become? When bhakti enters music, it becomes... What Kirtan. did Meera do? Kirtan, correct. So bhakti can be in any form. In whatever we consume, in whatever we do, whatever action we do... So just like Andar did through garlands, we have different bhaktas who were able to offer their devotion to Bhagavan. So today we are going to have lots of little gopikas and krishnas who are going to do garlands and offer to the deities in your house. Yes, ready? Uh, auntie, I want to ask one thing. Mm. Um... You, uh, we all do garlands, but why do we do garlands? Well, it's a form of, so in general, flowers bring a lot of joy, right? Whenever you see flowers bloom, you feel a lot of joy, right? So when you offer it to Bhagavan, it is like wearing ornaments. Are you wearing a chain or something? So why do you wear, see, auntie is wearing a chain, I'm wearing jumkas. It enhances the inner beauty within us, right? So this is just a form that we do. So whenever we do archana to Bhagavan, we will use flowers. But when we string it and do it, it is like a string of bhakti that is offered to Bhagavan. It also is used for decoration, right? So you, you can see in temples where big, big garlands are made and offered. You know, I have seen garlands where like six people have to carry it and then offer it to Bhagavan, like in Tirupati, um, uh, Balaji and Padmanabha Swami <laughs> temple. I'm going on August, I'm going to Tirupati. Good. So it is a form of bhakti that we offer. So today we also have another auntie who is going to help us teach. She is ex, she's an expert in making garlands. Ram Ram Ramyanji, namaste. Ram. So she is going to also guide us through garland making. Uh, I have seen many uh, photos of her garlands and I've always wanted her to be part of this workshop because she's going to teach us some, some quick, tricks as well in making the knots, how to tie it very, very beautifully. So I'm very happy that Ramya auntie could join us today. Welcome you, uh, Ramya ma'am. Thank you, Ani. Thank you. Okay. So now we start. What flowers do you have? Okay. What? We'll do champangi first. We'll do the white flower first. Yes. Who, 
let me see how many of you have the white flower. Can you show? And then we can take a call accordingly. One, two. Ah, okay, good. I think we will go with that. Okay, so whenever you are doing um, a flower garland for Bhagavan, make sure that you don't put the flowers on the ground. You always have to make sure that it is on a plate or a tray, a neat plate or a tray. Good. How many of you have the colored wool? Ramya, ma'am, can you put your uh, camera a little bit lower so that we can see the stringing? Yeah. How many of you have the colored? Ah, okay. I can see one, two, three. Very good. Four. Oh, I love that blue. I should get it looks very pretty. Okay. So now we will, I'm going to use a pink one to contrast uh, the white flower. So where is Ramya auntie? Can you see her stringing as well? Yeah, Ramya, I'm use uh, the, can you see mine, uh, Vani? Yes, I can. Um, can you can turn your the... plate? So that we, can you turn the plate so that we can see the white flower? Ah, yes. Okay. So, yes. Okay. So now you can watch both me and auntie. You're going to take two flowers together, the white flower. Two of them. Ramya ma'am, little bit, your camera has to be little bit, uh, you have to come a little bit closer to the camera. Two flowers together. So leave little bit of your string so that you can use it to tie a knot at the end. Now I'm going to show it here. Place it in such a way so that the two flowers are on your index finger and the thumb is on top of it. Okay. Now what you do, you take it around underneath and you take it twice. So you take two flowers, place it on your left index finger, place your thumb on top of it and then roll the string twice under. Yes. Now continue holding it. Now you see the loose string, the loose side. What you do, you hold it and you turn. You hold it like a triangle and you turn. And then put the two flowers inside and gently pull the longer end. Don't worry, I will say I will do it again. The knotting takes a little uh, little while to get practiced. So again, uh, so ma'am, I had a few network issues, so I wasn't able to. Start. Yeah, I'll do it again, Kanama. Don't worry. So you take. Take one flower, again place it on your index finger, watch auntie too. You can watch me and auntie at the same time. So one under on your index finger, hold it using your thumb. Can you see me holding? Ramya ma'am, can you show the holding part? Ah. Now you have three flowers now, one, two, three. Now only do the knot for the second and the third flower, the new flower and the second of the previous set. So roll it underneath. You can roll it twice just because we are all just starting. So you will roll it twice. And then for the knotting part, do a triangle. Can you see a triangle here? Using your index finger and your thumb, do a triangle. Flip the triangle, put it inside the second and the third. Now leave your hand, but keep holding the flower using your left hand and pull the longer end. Okay, I'm going to guide every one of you. Who is ready? The... Bharati, did you get it? 
Ma'am, I didn't get the knotting part. Ah, knotting part. See, you have the string here. Ramya, ma'am is showing. You have the string there. Yes, ma'am. Stretch it, and then use your index finger and your thumb to sort of fo form a triangle. Do you see a triangle here? One, two, three. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Now turn the triangle so that it will it will have a cross mark underneath, and put the flower inside the triangle and leave your hand. And then pull the longer part. Ma'am, uh, Auntie, can you again show? I am not yes. getting uh, how to do it. Um, okay, watch Ramya. I'm I'm going to. Um, okay, Ramya, Auntie is taking Auntie, one flower. Yeah, I think the triangle part. I think they are not getting it properly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll take time. Last time it almost mm -hmm. took one hour for yes. everybody to get it. So one flower. Now. that flower and the previous flower you take it underneath and do a do a circle you got that part yes auntie yes. okay now you have the longer part the longer string yes yes now take the string and then hold using your index finger and your thumb do you see auntie holding using my index finger and my thumb ah uh, now turn after you hold you turn after you turn just bring it closer to the flower and insert the two into the flower after you insert hold it leave the other hand and then pull okay soumya did you get it sarvina did you get it bharati vandada bharati Okay, I can't see Bharati's words. Who is this? I'm correct. Ah, correct, Karna. Correct. Sarvina has done it correctly. Ah, uh, who's that? Vishuddha. Did you get the knot? I'm going to show the knot one more time. Ramya, ma'am, can you show one more time? So yes. you hold. Ma'am, is this okay? Yes, correct. Correct. Continue. Now, take one flower. Hold it. Who's that? Ma'am Anushka. Ah, correct, An Anushka. Correct. Others who are trying out, please switch on. Sumit, did you get it, Karna? Ah, good. I want to see the knots. So hold the flower. two at a time you circle from the bottom now put on the on the end that is loose hold it using your index finger and your thumb turn it around and then put it inside the can you see you turn it and then put it on with two flowers insert it with two flowers now leave the hold it and leave the hand pull the longer end again ma'am is it like this ramya uh, ramya ma'am you have to we can't yeah. see your flower yeah uh, can you come a little bit closer to the video camera yeah move the plate and then come little closer ah yes yes Yes. Can you show the back part? Ah, uh, can you see? So it should come almost like a necklace. Good. Who's that? Ah, uh, Mahati, you have done this way. One flower this way and one flower this way. Ah, uh, okay. Good. Yes, ma'am. Good. Bharati, did you get it? Bharati, can I walk you? Trying to not. Ah, okay. Can you lower your camera a little bit? I'll walk you through it. 
those of you who did not get the note others keep watching watching aunty bharati i'll walk you through it karna okay so you're holding the flower okay hold on um see the flower should be towards you the stem should be outside are you a left handed person no okay 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 so can you see i'm going to cut this and i'm going to walk you through this i'll get parthi look at aunty those of you who have not gotten uh, the knot yet look at me parthi look at aunty so you have the end here the loose end yes keep the stem up and hold using your left hand ah good now to underneath got it got it can everybody mute i think somebody is on unmute and there is a lot of noise so you you have it like this yes so you should have on your left hand between your index finger and your thumb the two flowers should be there right now you put two rounds underneath yes okay now take the other end okay and then do a small u here do you see like a u ulta u ah uh, turn it around turn it around ah uh, put it inside put the flower inside Mm. Leave now. Hold and leave. Now pull the other end. Did you get the knot? No. Look here, Bharati. Look here. You have the string here. Hold. only one just one hold just one i think you did it twice hold just once there do you see turn your hand put the flower inside now hold using your thumb and pull the loose end no one more time let's try here did you hold do you see the cross mark here at the at the end do you see the cross mark here now turn Sumit, did, did you get it? Shruti, Soumya, Abhirami. Sharvari, you got it. Can I see? Tejaswini, did you get it? I almost got it. Okay. Anybody else who didn't get the knot? I got a small one. Ma'am, I couldn't get the knot, ma'am. So who didn't get it? Hari Priya, ma'am. Where are you? I can't see you, Hari Priya. Where are you, ma? Is your video on, Hari Priya?
can you switch it on so that i can walk you through it ah you're there okay bharati watch aunty one more time hari priya you also watch flowers there hold it straight circle underneath you can do two if you want two circles underneath yes let me yes, know when you're done yes um, now yeah yes now you have the longer end end right the shorter end is on your left hand this one keep holding that don't leave that you have the longer end do a small knot here do you see hold it using your index finger and your thumb yes now put the flower inside that take the keep holding and then take the flower inside now the flower is set inside do you see now leave the leave the hand so it will be hanging like this pull the longer end if you don't get it we'll do it one more time don't worry the first day is always challenging and then you will get it hari priya did you get it no ma'am okay one more time do you see the flower hold the flower mm. take two kanama you are using arali right take two if you are taking arali take two arali usually is better off than using needle or the other stick so you have to hari priya you are trying using arali right can you see yes ma'am okay now two underneath yes ma'am okay now hold hold S A G. Ah, S A G. S A G. S A G. Did you hold? Do you do you see sort of a uh, a pillar here between my index and my thumb? Yes, ma'am. Ah, hold. Keep hold. Keep holding. Take the flower inside. <laughs> Take the flower inside. Take the stem of the flower inside. now pull the longer end did you get it yes ma'am good very good bharati vandita bharati no one more time show me what you are doing i'll walk you through it don't worry last time for some of the kids we had to do 10 tries before they got it but then once they got it they made big garlands two flowers is the stem up upwards bharati stem is up you have one or two flowers how many do you have the others who are continuing watch uh, watch ramya aunty she is doing different colors and then she is doing it like a necklace i am watching it i am doing this for folks who don't have the grip of the knotting yet bharati you got it kanna okay now hold ah two rounds underneath take it from underneath kanna don't do it on the top take it from underneath here one two done yes now Uh, show me put your hand a little lower uh, so that i can see the uh, see it in the camera bharati or lift the camera up a little bit ah good okay so now the the two flowers should be between your uh, uh, index left hand between your index finger and the thumb are you holding it like this ah good now do this do do this keep it straight have the thread here watch ah uh, one ah uh, now here 
Hold it straight. 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 See, your index finger should be at the top. Your thumb should be at the bo ah, bottom. Now, take the flower inside that. It is like a pillar, right? So, so take the flower inside the pillar. Excuse me, ma'am. Which side should face us, ma'am? One second, one second, one second. Did the flower go inside? Make it closer, Kanna. So when you do this, Bharati, watch here. Ah, make it ah, closer. Correct. Make it closer and then take the flower inside. Put it inside. Yes, after you put it inside, hold using your index finger. Now pull the other end. Ma'am, which side should face us, ma'am? Um, uh, who's asking? Mahati, ma'am. What is the question, Karna? Which side should face us, ma'am? Which, uh, what do you mean by side? Stem on flower, ma'am. So, the up, if you're doing it like this, like flat, the flower will face you. If you're doing it like this, the stem will face up. Okay. Only then you will be able to put the knot closer to the stem. If you do it the other way around, you will be doing the knot on the flower, which you don't want. Right? Okay. Okay. Mm. Anybody else who didn't get the knot? Ah. Ma'am, I did. Good job, Haripriya. Who else didn't get it? Auntie me, Vishuddha. Where is Vishuddha? I can't see you, Kanna. Where are you? We should, uh, is your uh, video Andy, after we finish the first flower the next hmm. flower when we are doing it should we wrap the needle uh, uh sorry uh, should we wrap thread. the thread along with the first flower or should we wrap the second flower individually so you're starting with two i want everybody to listen for a second so you start with two and then the first time you do two together the next time you do the third flower and the second one. Next time you do fourth and the third. Next you do fifth and the fourth. Only then you will get the necklace pattern. Where is uh, Ramya auntie? Uh, see how, how big she has done. Can you show Ramya ma'am? Can you see aunties? That is how it will look. So every time you do the first time you do. After that. You do the second and the uh, second and the third together. Next time you do the fourth and the third together. Next you do fifth and the fourth together. Bharati, did you get it? I think most of you got it. You still look at Auntie Bharati. Look at Auntie. So you have, you have between your index finger and your thumb, you put the two flowers inside and put it towards you. And then hold it with your thumb here. And then pull the longer end. Try, try, keep trying. Last time. If you didn't get the first day, they got it the second day. And then they showed huge garlands. Like one kid had made like, I think four feet or something. Auntie? Mm -hmm. Auntie, I didn't get it. Who is it? It's Vishuddha, I said, you know. Show me, Kana. Can you focus on your camera? Ah, show me the flowers. Yes, the minute, Auntie. Uh, you have the stem towards, no, uh, can you cut this off and start from the beginning? Okay. okay. Take, take the two, take two flowers and then start from the beginning. I'll walk you through it. Just a minute, Auntie. Uh, auntie, when I um, 
pull the string uh, mm. when i do that uh, the knot is going far, uh, further away from the flower and not pulling the flower so, okay. okay good question so when you do that you watch that auntie when she do does the uh, pulling right of the of the knot i am trying to see so make sure that you have your thumb on it and then pull your right hand is loose but your left hand should never let go of the flower so after you put the knot here using your thumb just hold the string slightly so that it doesn't come out mm, correct bharati continue ma make okay. it closer make the and little can go it where is vishuddha aunty you can see me yes kanna i can see you can you focus the camera on the flower just a minute aunty aunty is this okay ah very pretty very nice shreya thank you sarvina very good ah uh, vishuddha can you can you show me the flower ah uh, you should not hold it like that it should be the other way round i'm here so can you see two flowers which is up the bottom ah the stem is up right so leave some space so that we'll have the space to tie the knot if required for the garland here two flowers one two underneath take it underneath see you're taking it upper don't take it on the top take it down one two Vani ma'am, Shruti ma'am. Ah, nice Shruti. Very Aunty. nice. Saumya. Saumya. Good Saumya. Good Saumya. You are doing it using my hand. Hmm. Ah, thank you, Aunty. Ah, tell me, Vishuddha. Everybody else mute. I'll just walk Vishuddha through it. Yes, Vishuddha. And from the bottom and so. You have to take it down, Kanna ma. Take it down. Take it down. down down in the flower don't do it on the top don't take your hand on the top take your hand on the bottom just like you have a ah, correct good very good one more one more ah don't let go of your Okay. Okay. Now, you you should have two rounds along along the flower. You have the longer end. Do you see, aunties? A little bit closer to the flower. Do a small hole like thing, like a pillar like thing, using your index finger and your thumb. Like this. Hmm. So you see, see a small space there. to put the flower inside ah put it inside after you put it inside hold hold it using your left thumb and then now leave the other hand pull the longer part okay aunty got it yeah turn 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 yeah turn good pull, pull pull now pull no see you have to turn kanama after after doing this you have to turn ah now pull hmm, pull 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 correct pull turn ah turn turn it got it got it yes aunty Ah, good. Bharati, did you get it? Hmm. Bharati, did you get it? Yeah. Okay. Anybody else? Mom, no, it's my color coming loose. Ah, it'll come. It'll get loose, Karna, because now when you're knotting, you're not holding the other flowers, right? And ah, see, see how um. Ramya aunty is doing it. So when she is doing the doing the knot, she also holds the other flowers using the left hand. 
so the more you hold it will get closer and it will not it will not get distorted with time you will we will get it okay mm. even if if few flowers fall in between it is okay ma'am i know you shall have a doubt yes kanna ramya ma'am can you can you do uh, can you show the knotting part alone we are going to ask her to show only the knotting part hold on can you start uh, start again uh, ramya ma'am like with a new thread then ma'am yes kanna ah good very good you got a hang of it very good very good see watch ramya aunty so two flowers the stem facing out or up two rounds underneath and then using uh, she is using the two fingers i i told you know the index finger and the thumb you can also use the two fingers these two fingers turn and put the flower inside and then don't leave the other hand now leave your right hand and then pull the longer end now the next one see what she is doing she is taking the third flower placing it there continue ramya ma'am placing it there and then doing the knot between the second and the third again same thing and you you pull it now next one hmm correct shreya good job niketana were you able to get it ah very good niketana very good uh, tejaswini can i see yours watch ramya aunty for the knot while i look at uh, the garlands here ah good job bharati bharati watch aunty here so two underneath right and then you have look here bharati you have sort of a hole here that you make using the thread right now put the flower inside that hole and then hold using your left hand pull the longer end try aunty i did it actually but it came out Ah, it's okay. It's okay with time. Even now, when I make garlands, you know, sometimes in between it falls off. I have to cut it and wrap it around. Mom, I have a doubt. I'm Mohisha. Yes, Mohisha. Ah, uh, Mom, um, I cannot hold my garden. Mom, I cannot hold my garland with my left hand because it's a bit long. What? What? Ah, is so it? after, um, Ramya, ma'am. can you take the blue garland and then add flowers to that see what auntie is doing so after you have moved till here what you do you leave this part and then hold only some of the flowers look at her see the other part is there away from her hand right but that closer to where you are doing the knot you hold the flowers because we can't hold one when you make big garlands you can thing in your hand right so what you do you leave some of it whatever you have done you leave it but the last part hold it using your left hand only then the flowers will be closer and you will get a grip um, strong grip for the flowers there in the thread did that answer your question yes ma'am thank you ma'am okay so if you have the yellow flowers Uh, Ramya, ma'am, can you show um, Samandi? So the knotting process is the same, but the way you hold the flowers is little different. You do it uh, as a pair. so if you have the yellow flowers just watch both uh, ramya aunty and me so you have 
ramya ma'am you take you put one on the top and then one on the bottom right opposite to each other correct now the same process you can do two and then do the knot on the top flower and then pull ramya ma'am we can't see the flower mm so one on the, the top one at the bottom and the stem close to each other again go underneath and then the knot on the top so you can continue with pairs one on the top one on the bottom you can do the same format if you have those pink flowers called arali what is it called in english i don't know lily what is it called lily no it's not lily ma'am should i cut the wire ramya ma'am can you just turn the camera a little bit you can do the same pattern with the white flowers also you can keep it in such a way that one flower is up one flower is down and then you can make the same garland so one two and then knot on the top again keep a keep another pair one two one on the top one at the bottom what was the question uh, shreya ma'am should i cut the white one and do the yellow one now yeah you can try the yellow one and see if you're able to get with one on the top and one at the bottom i uh, yes from me ma'am i can see it now okay ma'am i did uh, is this okay ah very good good job make sure you click a picture and and share it on the drive meeda are you done uh Soumya, this is Soumya and uh, Shruti. Tejaswini, I have not seen yours. Can you show? So when you hold. hold the two flowers very close to the previous set these flowers are very friendly flowers so you want them to stay next to each other close to each other in in school you like to sit close to your friends right yes or no so keep it closer to the previous set ramya ma'am can you show what you have done she is very quick in making garlands also ah uh, see very pretty Uh, somebody is trying roses is that roses uh, who is that sarvina is it roses ah good what are you trying niketana pink flower ah pink flowers good tejaswini what are you trying i'm not sure if tejaswini is uh, yellow flowers kana what are those i am not able you you have blur background so i am not able to see the flowers sumed what are you trying yellow flowers i am telling you yellow flowers ah yellow flowers good is it bharati yes ma'am okay so yellow flowers look at aunty
yes one flower on the top one flower at the bottom excuse me ma'am yes kanna i have to go outside can i send the pictures yes yes you can you can post it in the google drive sure and yes aunty one second one second thank you ma'am one and two and then put the knot on the top bye and thank you thank you kanna ram 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 now you do the knot and turn bharati turn it around turn it around turn and now pull abhishekha uh, tell me aunty this is uh, right and doing with lilies ah correct very nice very pretty if you have more flowers just complete it and post the picture okay aunty aunty ah good bharati very good you got the knot very good sumit did you get it got it good somya did you get it ah good somya's garland is long good somya you have only champangi you don't have any other flowers i have it but it's so uh, small and uh, i'm not having it so okay so look at ramya aunty so with that yellow she's also added little red roses to make it more colorful see can you see so one rose at the top one rose rose at the bottom and then same thing do the circle at the bottom and then knot on the top so how many we can do ramya ma'am like three pairs and then one red that look nice one 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 yellow one red ah okay one yellow one red she suggesting one yellow one red so one pair of yellow flowers and then one pair of red flowers it depends on how many you have if you have more of the yellow then you can do two pairs of yellow and then and then one red thank you uh, lily what will be nice to match okay, flower mama i auntie i have yeah uh, the red ones and the yellow ones ah what what is your question i asked that uh, with lily what will be the match i want to add more flowers that's why i asked which is the white flowers yeah with the white flowers ah with the white flowers you can add so if you are doing doing it this way where you are doing like this right instead of doing it like this you are doing it like this do you see the difference okay what is the difference so the first But time in in, in, in uh, the white flowers we should do it with the uh, stem and in the yellow flowers we should do it with the top ah with the top correct correct now no? yes kanama i'll just complete the one second yes we should so after that what do you do ma'am mm. what was your question no that's it only i asked ah. i asked that uh, ah. with white flowers what what will be matching ah red will go well with white usually red will go well so you can add red who was the oh. other person who had a question ma'am ma i have a doubt who is that niketana yes niketana uh, ma'am i did my first flower the mm. yeah mm. and if i want to do the next flower it's coming a little loose for me okay so make sure that you hold the first flower with your thumb and your two fingers and then place the next set that will take time the other thing is your hands are very little right all your children the hands are very small so you find it little bit difficult to hold so if the flowers are little apart from each other it is okay 
it is okay okay ma'am so it might not look at aunties it's like so thick and close to each other that will come with practice so it's okay if one flower is here and then you do the next flower here it is okay when when we just start see excuse me huh? one second karna so if it is a little far from each other it is okay now you can place the next one here but with time you will be able to do it closer to each other yes kanna ma ma'am um, finding it hard to uh, do double side can i do uh, do single side right if single side works for you do single side once you get a hang of the knot you will be able to do it we'll continue okay. practicing tomorrow don't throw away the flowers okay whatever you have bought save it for save it so that we'll practice tomorrow also and then tomorrow i we can also learn to make uh, druva grass mala uh, argampul mala and then if you have if you can buy betel nut leaves you can buy betel leaves you can buy betela mala so druva grass is very um, close to ganapati pillayar and then the betel leaf um, garland usually is offered to which god hanuman hanuman anuman correct so you can learn that tomorrow while we are practicing this aunty will show those two garlands also so that you can learn how to do it and then with practice you will get it ma'am after uh, after we cut it can we join two garlands two garlands yes so you just need to have enough space to join lot of times you and then you will do the knot right after you do the knot you can just cut off the extra thread if you if you see extra thread you can just safely cut that off so it will look like a join garland now yes, auntie actually i just now got how to do the knot so uh, i have started doing the garland ah garland good again. who got a hang of it now mom anushka anushka yes. good anushka with good i think by no, no, actually it still is a bit it still is a bit uh, bad but then i think i'm getting it a bit better you will get it with time you will get it look at auntie now she is combined i think uh, who asked vishuddha asked right vishuddha look at auntie so she is joined the white flowers and the red flowers so you can do yellow red or you can do white red you can also add tulsi leaves to this and then do three colors in whatever way you want to do and you want to make it creative it will look good mom it mom it came like a bucket ah <laughs> very nice very colorful good job sarvina okay so we have to end the class today whatever flowers are remaining what you should do you you try practicing with little bit of flowers and then whatever is remaining save it for tomorrow so that we continue practicing tomorrow Yes, ma'am. Uh, how do I do with the yellow flower? Yellow flower, you do one at the top and one at the bottom. Ramya, ma'am, can you show? So you do one at the top and one at the bottom. So instead of inst for for um, the white flower, we did the stem facing outside and then the flower facing bottom, right? For this, one at the top. and one at the bottom ah. ma'am is it like this yes correct keep it closer you see the the flower ending right it you make sure that you keep it closer correct okay can you put mine ma'am after this how should i do it ah uh, hari priya well done can you show the garland ah good job very good you can do very good you got a hang of the knot yes ma'am ma'am after good, this good. how do i do who's ah tejaswini good job ma'am you won't be able to see clearly because of the back side camera but uh, yeah it is made out of the yellow flowers when i cut finished and for the left over i used the uh, roses okay look at uh, uh, shreya look at ramya aunty so one at the top one at the bottom you circle 
the string at the bottom uh, who is that mohisha good job good job sarvina ah sumit very nice you got the hang of the knot ah good post it on the google drive i i will definitely see okay it's past time kana we have to end the class we will continue tomorrow so if you are if you are no i'll just take 30 more seconds for uh, who's the kuti shreya look at aunty ramya ma'am you just show once for shreya if you are not able to get it we'll continue tomorrow okay ma'am mm. i request everybody else to just stay muted for a second go ahead ramya ma'am Shreya, just take a small piece. Otherwise, the whole thread will get knotted. Just take a small piece. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Watch, Auntie. So one at the top, one at the bottom. Circle underneath. You can circle it twice, and then knot at the top. Okay. Okay. We'll end with the Shanti add, mantra. How do I add another flower? Ah, you take two more and then place it close, as close as possible. Yeah, and then follow the same procedure. You can do two underneath, one and then the knot at the top, and then pull the longer end. Ma'am, should I keep the next flower like this? top and bottom again top and bottom if this should I keep yes to correct 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 okay ma'am okay we'll How end with add another flower. color in this you can just the next flower can be something else okay sarve bhavantu sukhinah sarve santu niramayah सर्वे भद्राणी पश्यन्तु शांति 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 हरि ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओम हरि ओम तत्सत हैव अ गुड इवनिंग विल मीट अगेन टुमारो कंटिन्यू प्रैक्टिसिंग थैंक यू वेरी मच रामिया मैम फॉर जॉइनिंग एंड हेल्पिंग अस आउट राम 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 मैम राम 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 बाय राम 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 मैम बाय बाय राम राम हैव अ गुड इवनिंग राम 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 जी राम राम थैंक यू रम्या मैम